If you guys need help gearing up for any of the new content in Grand Theft Auto Online, check out G2A with the link in the description and use cashback code BOSS if you want to save a little bit extra as well. Hey guys, so in today's video, we're going to be talking about all of the new content that Rockstar has added today in Grand Theft Auto Online, plus everything you need to know, including some rare items that are only going to be here for a limited time and a whole lot more. So Rockstar added two new vehicles today. I say new. They've been in the game since day one, but now they're officially available on the Southern San Andreas Super Sports site, and you can store them in your garage. So the first is the Mammoth Patriot. Rockstar says the original and best way to invite the loathing of every smug-faced, tree-hugging Delante driver on the interstate. The Mammoth Patriot is three tons of solid lane-straddling liberty coming straight out of the days when you could still afford a gas tank. For the first time in Grand Theft Auto Online, this iconic American hunk of steel is now available for purchase on the Southern San Andreas Super Auto site along with a bevy of new mod options at your local LS Customs. So that last line is important. Yes, the Mammoth Patriot does have some new modification options, which is pretty cool. And as Rockstar said, it's available on the Southern San Andreas Super Sports site, and you can pick it up for $50,000. So it's actually not terribly expensive. None of the cars that Rockstar are adding to the in-game sites that have been here since day one are too terribly expensive. That's the first vehicle, the Mammoth Patriot. And the second one is by far the more interesting one, I think, and that is the Chariot Romero Hearse. Rockstar says, if you're looking to make a serious first impression, silently cruising up in a Chariot Romero Hearse is tough to beat. That used to mean beg, borrow, or steal, but no matter how hard you tried, you can never seem to get rid of that lingering secondhand hearse odor. Now you can buy your very own corpse transport, complete with that new car smell from Southern San Andreas Super Auto. So Rockstar, if you didn't catch that, is making fun of the fact that the only way to get a hearse in Grand Theft Auto Online before this was either to have it duplicated by someone or to have someone else, you know, use a hearse to get one to spawn in. So they're kind of making fun of their own game mechanic right there, which is a little funny in my opinion. Uh, the hearse is available for $45 thousand dollars now i'm a little surprised rockstar released these vehicles when they did if you watched my video yesterday on the halloween surprise 2018 i fully thought that they were going to save the hearse for around halloween time i thought that made more sense and the mammoth patriot i thought would have been a cool vehicle to release maybe during thanksgiving because it's got that patriot name sort of the american theme so I thought that's what Rockstar was going to do. Apparently not. Again, they have confused us all with their plans, but I still think it's pretty cool. These are two great new vehicles. The Patriot, obviously, with its new mods, and the fact that the hearse is so rare or was so rare uh, makes it a very unique and cool vehicle. Now, after that, you can log on this week to get a rare item in Grand Theft Auto Online. That would be the Omega Nightclub T-shirt. So you have to log on anytime this week uh, to get the Omega t-shirt, which is cool because this is the final nightclub shirt that hadn't been released yet. So if you owned the Omega Club, you didn't have a t-shirt to match, well now you do, and the only time you can get it is this week, otherwise it will be gone forever. There's also some GTA money and RP bonuses that are going on as well. Some of them are returning from previous weeks, like the first, which is business battles. Now you're not getting double cargo, you're getting the weird thing, double money in RP. I don't know why Rockstar are doing double money in RP for delivering the goods instead of double goods, but they are, and I think that's kind of strange. Also, you get 25% off of champagne at the bar this week at the nightclub, and punters are sticking around all night with nightclub popularity levels sustaining themselves for twice as long before decreasing, meaning your wall safe stays racking up cash while you're out of the office. So that's kind of cool. However, I think the biggest one is terabyte client jobs are double money and RP, which is really cool. We'll actually be talking about this a little bit later because it's seriously an amazing way to make money, but terabyte client jobs are now double money and RP. And as Rockstar announced last week, Running Back Remix is gonna be continuing through the following week, which is October 1st. It has double money and RP going on for it as well. Now, in addition to that, there are some nightclub and business discounts, including 25% off all the nightclubs, add-ons, and renovations, 25% off nightclub warehouse upgrades, 
25% off of nightclub warehouse uh, technicians. Hangers are 50% off. Gun running resupplies, 50% off. And after hours clothing, 25% off as well. So some nice discounts right there. We're also getting some hefty discounts on aircrafts and vehicles. The B-11 Strike Force is 25% off. The Mammoth Tula is 40% off. The Buckingham Pyro, 40% off. The P996 Laser, 40% off. The P Fister Comet SR, 30% off. Overflawed Tyrant, 30% off. The Trufate Nero is 35% off. And the Heavy APC is 40% off. So some nice supercars, some nice weaponized jets that you can get your hands on for a whole lot cheaper, including one of the newest ones, the B11 Strike Force, that only came out really a couple of weeks ago. So if you you know haven't bought that but you want it, uh, now might be a good time to get your hands on it. And the final thing that's going on this week that you potentially might have is the targeted sale. Again, if you don't know what targeted sales are, they're basically sales that are given to about maybe 5 to 10% of the player base and online. So the targeted sale this week is 25% off of the terabyte and 30% off of terabyte renovations. So I would imagine that this targeted sale would only go out to players that own the terabyte because if not, there's no point to get this sale because you don't need it. So again, that's probably only going to go out to about 5 to 10% of people that don't own the terabyte. So it's going to be a pretty rare sale that not a lot of people are going to have. But anyways, that's all the information I've got for you guys in this video today. That is everything that is going on this week in Grand Theft Auto Online. New vehicles, rare unlocks that are only available for a certain amount of time huge discounts, and a whole lot more. If you guys did go on to enjoy this video, though, a like rating would, of course, be awesome. And also, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new or you like daily GTA 5 videos like this. With all the way, guys, like I said, thanks so much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.